Hey folks, and welcome back to Glenn and Adrian's Rock Talk. That's Adrian. And that's Glenn. And today, we go back to take a second look at the band Opeth. And it just so happens that they released an album three days ago as we record this. The album's name is Last Will and Testament. It's their 14th album. Came out on November 22nd. It's getting really good reviews. A lot of people say, oh my gosh, this might be album of the year for this particular style of music. And let me see, genre, progressive death metal. <laughs> That's kind of what they say. The album is a concept album set in the post-World War I era, unfolding the story of a wealthy conservative patriarch whose wife is infertile, whose last will and testament reveals shocking family secrets. They don't use traditional song titles, you know, they've got basically one through seven for the first seven tracks, and then there's a, a final song called A Story Never Told. So I haven't listened to the entire album as a piece. By the way, Ian Anderson is on flute on this, and also does spoken word. But yeah, generally, this uh, album is causing a commotion, and we thought we ought to take a look at it, because we were interested in what we heard last time. We listened to Window Pane. At the time, we had mentioned, well, we're not really a big fan of the Cookie Monster voice, but that particular release didn't have the Cookie Monster voice. We're like, great, that's fine. Apparently, there is Cookie Monster voice on this release, but <laughs> even people that were kind of divided on that before say it's not really so bad on here. Like, it's it's not obnoxious. Like, it, it, it actually works in the context of whatever's going on. So I'll take their word for it. Let's go ahead and see what we have. This is a uh, basically a lyrics video. They don't have any actual official videos out yet, but I figure this will be good enough for us to check it out and get a sense. All right, Adrian, you haven't seen this, right? No, nope, I'm All looking right. forward to it. <laughs> All uh, right. Progressive death metal with a Mellotron. Yeah, indeed. It's going to be good, I think. <laughs> it sounds promising. All yeah. right, let's check it out. Oh, 
Prog style jazz like beginnings, <laughs> metal boom <laughs> complete with Cookie Monster. Yeah. Impressive lyrics, uh, changing rhythms, <laughs> harp music, Ian Anderson on flute. This musically, this song has something for everyone. <laughs> Yeah, it's there's a whole boatload of stuff in there, and uh, I thought it was a great piece. I mean, I really enjoyed how it was put together. Um, you know, it, nothing was too much. You know, it 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 all balanced itself out really well. And and my own personal thought here is that it also the author isn't taking himself too seriously. You know, like it, yes, it's one of those macabre pieces, or you know, and there's a whole storyline in here. It's a concept album, but you know, some of the lines just made me think, okay, <laughs> you know, this is almost a little bit of levity in here too. You know, and I liked the way some of those lines were delivered too. You know, like with sometimes with lines uh, and rhythms that never came back. You know, but mm. but would actually get out a particular line of text that they wanted to say at that point. And it's funny, even, you know. The part where the Cookie Monster voice came in even had the Cookie Monster grammar, you know, like <laughs> I eat cookie, you know, it was kind of like it was, was kind of like that in the in the words. It kind of looked like like skipping the unnecessary prepositions or, or uh, connectors, whatever. I guess the video uh, is kind of portraying part of the uh, concept album, like maybe this is chapter one or paragraph four, actually. That's yeah, yeah, it. yeah. That's what it is. Death Row Toll. <laughs> it's one of the one of the comments on here. Death Row Toll. Mm. Uh, <laughs> just, oh. <laughs> just kind of That's funny. great. I yeah, like yeah. yeah. So yeah, you know, I'm uh, I'm very interested in hearing this whole album. I don't know if I'm going to do that yet. Maybe we should talk about it. Decide if we want to give it a listen and, and a review, or if we want to listen to a few other tracks. It might be possible to. Uh, look at something else later so we'll all right or maybe we'll wait a, a week or so and see if anything interesting drops you know like an actual music video or something i mean it kind of looks like a lot of what's up there already are uh, not necessarily official music videos but they just you know behind the scenes or what have you so yeah folks anybody that is already familiar with this album if you want us to check out something in particular on it next leave that suggestion below please and we will uh, strongly consider it but yeah, I think at some point we should get around to more of this record for sure and, and get to know yeah. it because it sounds promising, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that sounded really good to me, to my ears. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, that was something else. Yeah. <laughs> All right, folks, why don't, why don't you let us know what you thought of it? And of course, leave suggestions as you have them. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And if you enjoyed our presentation, please subscribe. All right, thanks so much for joining us, and we will catch you on the next one. All right, take care, folks. See you all later. Bye.